Um, as of my recounting now, uh, all of those we arrested have had prior criminal records. Last night, uh, the mayor alluded to the fact that our shot spotter gunshot detection system uh, recorded numerous shots fired in the vicinity of this uh, area last night. Uh, the total number of activations was 48. Now, that doesn't mean 48 shots were fired. It means 48 different activations. Some of these activations were six, eight, or ten shots fired all at once. That's a single activation. But there was a great deal of gunfire uh, in the area last night between uh, 30th and 51st and Keith to Center. Seven squads were uh, damaged last night. One unmarked squad, as you have seen, was set on fire. One marked squad was uh, smashed by rioters and totaled. Uh, another marked squad was hit by gunfire, single shot to the trunk area. As you saw last night, we used the Bearcat as a means of protecting our deployed officers. That was hit by eight rounds of gunfire last night. Two of those rounds struck the windshield. One squad and one wagon were struck by bricks, breaking their windows out. We had six businesses set on fire last night. The BP gas station at 43rd and Burleigh was destroyed. The O'Reilly Auto Parts at 35th and Fond du Lac was destroyed. Jet Beauty at 35th and Burleigh was burned. The BMO Bank Branch at 36th and Burleigh has been heavily damaged by fire. Liquor stores at 22nd and Fond du Lac and 21st and Hopkins were both heavily damaged. The one at 22nd and Fond du Lac was destroyed. Obviously, the loss of all of these businesses is the loss of dozens and dozens of jobs in that community.